We take the real world, we make it fake. Then we take the fake world we built based off the real world and rebuild it in for mocap. So we take real things, make them fake, take the, ver the fake versions of the real things and make them real again. Every second of movement you see in Beyond is motion capture, ranging from you know simple, simple in-game motions, walking, turning, all the way to uh, stunts, fights, four-person fights, four-person fights on uh, train roofs, uh, to performance capture, to full facial and, and, and body capture at the same time. <sighs> Go in, damn it. The games we make at Quantic Dream are, are based in reality. We rely heavily on motion capture because uh, we have to populate this world with characters. Um, children playing in a playground, uh, people walking, getting on a train, uh, every, everything that actually happens in real life has to happen in our game and the only way we can really capture that, the only practical way to get that is to capture the real thing. We have to rebuild the world in out of cardboard and tape and foam. We have to make sure it matches the what's in the game and we have to make sure that we can actually capture with it because there are limitations to motion capture. It, it's a, it's optical, so I mean, you can't have someone go under a blanket or into a box. You won't capture anything. So we have to take all of that into consideration. A car door has weight. We can't use a car door in motion capture because it's shiny and it's really heavy and uh, <laughs> we can't see through it. So we have to build the approximate of a car door, but it has to at least have some of the real properties of a car door because just closing a cardboard car door does not, doesn't, doesn't play the same as, as a real car door. Someone's always decided for me. It's time I make my own choices. Performance capture is, is just, is really, you know, it's, it's digital acting. And the trickiest part of performance capture is, is the preparation. It's, it's getting people ready to, to, to perform. Uh, depending on how many actors you have, it takes a while to put the 90 plus markers on the face. They all have to be placed specifically for them to work right on the rig. Uh, so you have someone sit in a chair and it's almost like a, you know, they can meditate or do whatever, close their eyes and you just carefully place a hundred markers on their face. It, it, takes, uh, it takes much longer than putting the markers in the body. Uh, and after that, after all of that, you, you're shooting. And in the process of shooting, um, for every single shot, we have to make sure we got a reasonable amount of data. It's the equivalent of checking the gate, you know. The game itself really requires uh, emotion and subtlety, and I think there's no other way to, to capture all that than the way we're doing it. You know, they rely on each other. We, we, we couldn't get this performance without performance capture, and it wouldn't be worth getting unless it was from these people. So it's, 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 really, it's, it's a really great mix of, of technology and, and talent.